everyone, it's Miss Frodo. And Domo. And we are here with another LEGO DC Comics Superheroes Mighty Micros set. This is Batman vs. Catwoman. Yes, the Batman. And Catwoman. I have to admit, I think if you haven't noticed yet, like watching, looking at these Mighty Micros, the facial expressions on these characters are just so cool. Uh, like this one, you have like the, you know, the kind of like the sideways smirk, like, you know, I'm too serious for this. And then you have the cool like, Catwoman face. So all the other ones are kind of similar in that kind of sense where they have like these really cartoony faces, which I just love about these figures. It's like a face you'd see on Batman in the Lego movie. Right, exactly. I am the Batman. And there are other DC sets. Oh, come on. So we have Robin versus... Who's that? That's Bane. The okay. one that broke Batman's back. And then the Flash versus... Mr. Freeze. Okay. Well, Ice to meet you. Well, there's a, there's a frozen guy in Batman, but there's a different frozen guy in Flash. To be honest, that might not be Iceman, but he, uh, uh, Mr. Freeze, but... I assume that's Mr. Freeze. It's the dude from Flash. If you guys can see Flash on, oh gosh, the CW, I think it's on. I don't know what channel it's on. I see it on, like, Netflix. You know what? You might actually be right. I'm pretty sure that's not Mr. Freeze. Now that I it's, look at this. It's the dude from the Netflix version of The Flash. Somebody let us know who that <laughs> is. <laughs> He's the cold, icy guy. That is not Mr. Freeze. Yeah, apparently. Oh, well. All right, let's crack this open. And we'll put it together. Domo's letting me do Catwoman. Ooh, a separate box for capes. How That's many pieces exciting. have we got? 79. 79 pieces. All right, this shouldn't take us too long. We'll come right back. are back with Batman and Catwoman and I love yes Batman's very cool we'll check him out in a second but Catwoman is super cool so she's got let me take her out again she looks kind of creepy we decided she looks kind of like Venom from Spider-Man until bit. you put her mask on and then she just looks cool and she's got her little jewel that she stole yes and her little Catwoman utility belt Everyone needs a utility belt in a DC universe. And these are, we discovered this on the Marvel ones, they don't have the full leg. They have Miss Frodo legs. They have tiny little stubby legs, yes, like me. <laughs> so that they can fit in the tiny little car. She's got a little carton of milk. There's actually a cow on it. So it's like legit um. cow's milk. Um, and then she's got the front of her car, looks like a cat. It's got, if I take her out actually you can see better. So it's got the two ears and the little face here. And oh, it's got a cool. tail on the back and little burners at the back. Not as cool as Batman's burner. And she's got this little, is that called a fender? Spoiler. Spoiler. She's got a spoiler thing that you can move and it's like, yeah, cool. More so, aerodynamic gets you on the ground a little better. So she's, she's going to um, try to steal this diamond without getting caught by the Batman. That's right. Na 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 Batman is the best. Pcha! All right. So my Batman's dual wielding the extra batarang because he's just that cool. And what I did notice, let's take him out, similar to what Mr. Frodo was doing. Let's take away his batarang. So he does love his batarangs. We all know this, especially from that Lego movie. Like if you take off his helmet, 
he's not Bruce Wayne. He's a dude with some aviator glasses. Um, he's still pretty cool like that, though, really. Mm -hmm. But what I found out is that if you just barely put that the hat the scout the cowl on, kind of hard to see. But you can see like his eyes are all white. But if you push them all down, see if, if I get the light a little better. If you push it down, whoops, it's right here. So it's high. You push it down, then he gets really serious because his eyes squint and he's all angry. Yeah. I don't know if you can really see that necessarily, but it was interesting to me. It also has a, it looks like he has like the, the Batman outfit from like, um, oh. The original. Oh yeah, the Batman, the animated series kind of look to him. It's very classic um, Batman. Which is kind of like if you grew up in the 90s like I did, that's like the Batman that we all know and love. His cape is also really nice. It's not like a plasticky cape. It's actually like a nice little cloth, so it makes him look extra cool. And then the Batmobile. You do have the uh, larger tire than the smaller tire, you know, giving them a little more speed. Catwoman has the same tire style, Very true. By the way. He has the insignia, so that way everyone knows whose vehicle this is, so no one tries to take it, though everyone wants it. Um, sadly, he does not have a spoiler, but what he makes up without a spoiler, he makes up with a huge afterburner. <sighs> they can go extra fast, so. It's pretty sweet. It's got nice little fenders on it. Um... In general, just the detail is really nice for such a tiny little thing with so few pieces. I think it's really, really cool. So, I think now, Miss Frodo, I think our two people do battle. I should try to catch her. Though I think I should have the, the milk so that we can try to, like, lure you over here. You've already got two batarangs. <laughs> oh, I lost my... No, I lost my fireball. Oh, no. Ha -ha. <laughs> no. Uh -huh. And she gets away. <laughs> Because his edge is all messed up. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> Batman, not today. <laughs> oh, oh well. <laughs> Next time, Batman, though, we all know you have a soft spot for the Catwoman. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time. Oh. Oh! <laughs> Hope you enjoyed the video. As always, please like, subscribe, and comment below. Thanks for watching Miss Frodo's Toy Horde. Bye!